639, we're taking you on a zip trip to Gaffney this morning. It's time to chow down at a local sweet spot. 7 News is Christine Scarpelli live yeah. at Jolly Park in so Gaffney fun. with the owners of a gas station that sells what the locals call the most mm -hmm. irresistible donuts around. I agree, Christine. Irresistible. Yes. Oh, Fred, I know you love it. Fred is a huge fan of all our viewers. Sonny's Donuts. And I don't know okay. if you've ever seen Sonny before. He is the <laughs> kindest, most hard-working entrepreneur in other than Chris Garlic here. Then in Gaffney, this is incredible. So we're huge fans of these donuts. But photojournalist Ryan and I found these years ago, uh, introduced by one of our photographers ever since. Every time we come to Gaffney, we have some. Sonny's Donuts, you can see much more where this came from. Take a look. Roll up to this gas station in Gaffney, South Carolina, and believe it or not, you can fill up both tanks, your gas and your stomach. We're going to head inside for some of the best donuts in the Carolinas. I am in donuts in 1987, that today. I know how people love donuts. I know that clearly. Well, you have to love something to wake up just after midnight each day to do it. Sunny Pyong grew up in war-torn Cambodia. He says he and his family were forced to work and tortured in the jungle. He escaped to the U.S. and in 1981, along came a sweet opportunity. I asked a friend in Los Angeles and California how to learn making donuts. Sonny and his wife Lang switched coasts, brought the sunshine to the Carolinas and opened Sonny's Quick Stop in 2006. In 2012, Young began serving the breakfast that brightens our day. The word plain is not how I would describe this donut. No. How about perfect? Perfect. Perfect donut. works. <laughs> perfect donut. Young mixes and rolls the dough. He adds cinnamon and filling. Apple. Sour cream, old fashioned cake, tiger paw cinnamon roll. A unique treat. The buttermilk bar in original and blueberry. Those donuts are amazing. The customer favorite is glazed with a special sweet blend of sugar. I want customer love donut come back again. They sell breakfast croissants too and plenty of coffee. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And have a sunny day. Always. <laughs> <laughs> we have Sunny's favorite donut, the Tiger Claw here. And instead of saying let's eat, I think it only is fitting to say have, have a, a sunny, sunny day. day. <laughs> Is that not the most fun? I really hope. And photojournalist Ryan Goodman works so hard on that story. I hope you can see just how great these donuts are. So, Sonny, we've got him here. We've got Chris Garlock, who's performing at the Peach Festival, told you about arts and crafts. Go ahead and I want to hear this. Beautiful. We have a dessert competition at four, but I don't know. I don't know if you can beat the taste of these donuts. Sonny, thank you for coming this morning. Thank you for you showing are. off these donuts. You, you have a new donut that you made this morning. Photojournalist Ryan was showing us. It's red for what? Strawberry? Strawberry. Ooh, and the buttermilk flour. Uh, How is that different? It's a buttermilk flour. It's a buttermilk. It's a butter. It can melt in the, in the mouth when you bite and melt. So it's soft. It's soft. Tasty. 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 My favorite yeah. is the one right below the blueberry. And it's, you said that was cinnamon. It's cinnamon sugar crumb. Ooh, and I like that one because the flavoring the doesn't flavoring. overpower the donut. Yep. Can I brag on you? You wake up very early to make these donuts. I am. I wake up at 12.30. That's midnight, folks. Yeah. You then think I... we wake up early for this morning show? This is midnight. He starts making these donuts every day? Every day, six days a week. Now, do you ship them in or is it by hand? By hand. By hand, Not you saw ship in, by hand. Everything, everything handles in by hand. It's so good. Listen, thank, thank you. you for being such a great business, a great part of Gaffney, and then coming this morning. We really appreciate it. And we got to sure. mention Lang, your wife. Lang. My <laughs> wife, she's been busy with a customer right now. We're going to let Sonny go <laughs> because he's got to get back to his wife. And you guys run Sonny's Quick Stop that's just down the road by just the bridge. Just down the road by the bridge, yeah. Go see him for donuts and coffee. And I recommend, I'm going to say, I still like the cinnamon sugar crumb. That's still my favorite. But try the buttermilk bar. Sound good? Try buttermilk bar. Yep. All right. Try it. Try them for and yourself, You don't try, guys. you don't know. You don't know. Exactly. The Peach Festival this weekend, a great excuse. Come by, get breakfast, stay the whole day. We'll send it back to you. And I'm going to plug you. the apple fritters. I was there last week. I got some apple fritters with my donuts, and they gave me the baker's dozen. Ooh. Great, Christine. 
Now, Gaffney, it's just the, our first zip trip. Seven News visiting cities all over our area, and our next stop is Greenwood. Next Friday, we're going to take a closer look at what makes that city so special. We'll start here on Carolina Morning from 5 to 7 on 7 News. Then from 7 to 9, we'll be on the CW62. And don't forget, the fun continues from 9 to 10 a.m. on your Carolina. Now, to find out about future zip trips, just click on Zip Trips under the News tab at WSPA.com. Com. Quarter before seven, a live look from Hogback Mountain. A beautiful start to your Friday. We check your weather and your traffic next.